free Palestine! Vittorio Aragoni was seen as a true friend of the people of Gaza. And as an activist and writer, he made Gaza his home. A home he didn't even leave during the 2008 war with Israel. On Thursday, he was kidnapped by members of a Salafi group in Gaza. By Friday, he was confirmed dead. One of the group confessed about the rest of the group. This led us to the place where the activist was kept. We moved very quickly and we found the body. It was killed in a brutal way. The doctor confirms that it was killed hours before our arrival. On Thursday, the kidnappers posted a video of Aragoni blindfolded on YouTube. The video demanded the release of Salafi members held in Gaza's prisons. Among them, one of their leaders, Abu Walid al maktasi Gaza's two main Salafi groups, Al-Jihad wa Tawhid and Ansar al-Sunnah, are denying responsibility. <laughs> the video says a brigade of Salafi members is behind it. Al Jazeera also met Vittorio Aragoni last year. As a member of the international solidarity movement, he was accompanying Palestinian farmers onto their land inside the buffer zone. To the area Israel has declared off limits to them. He cared deeply for the Palestinians. They were family to him. And he will always be considered family, I'm sure, to the Palestinian people. Free, free Palestine! Aragoni risked his life to protect Palestinian rights. He was hoping to head home to Italy to see his sick father on Monday. Instead, his journey has ended in Gaza. Nicole Johnston, Al Jazeera, Gaza.